exercise-induced anaphylaxis that's associated with food allergy. Uh, tell me about that because it happens. It does. I've actually never seen it in my practice, but I've read about it. Uh, it is, a, it's a, a severe reaction that can occur. It's anaphylaxis, which is, you know, a systemic type reaction that can be severe. And it only happens if somebody eats a specific food and then they exercise within two hours after eating it. There's some specific foods, celery and wheat have been described, um, but they can, you can eat the food without exercising or you can exercise and you don't have a problem, but if you do the two in combination, it can result in an allergic type reaction. So does epinephrine uh, help with that or you just learn, you see the doctor, they tell you what, what not to eat, yeah. not to exercise yeah. after eating? Yeah, I mean, that would be the best, is just to avoid that process. Of course, if for some reason you accidentally got the food and didn't know it and exercise, then the epinephrine, of course, would be indicated. Your advice to mothers or to people that feel like they have food allergies? You have, need to see a board certified allergist in order to get, you know, appropriate history uh, and testing done. And usually you can come out with good answers with a good advice of what to do. Yes.